Hey guys, what's going on? It's me, Insightful, coming at you with a surprising video that I was not expecting to make, but if you watch my stream, you know that I solo shuffle, and whilst I solo shuffle, particularly on a DPS class, I try and make as much gold as I can. I happened to be going over to Zulgurub to have a go at getting the Raptor mount. Unfortunately, it didn't drop. Sad face for me. Um, and then I came over to Westfall, and I just was going to go check out the uh, buzzards for the small eggs and I just killed a few of these crabs on my way and lo and behold the meat and some of the clams from the murlocs were of surprising value so I thought I would share this quickly and let you guys maximize it whether this has something to do with Wintervale and the recipes like I've mentioned before I am not exactly too sure so guys to start this farm I would start at the northernmost part of the beach and I would honestly just run right down. I'm just going to kill some of these to kind of show you the prices and the drops. So you can see there the crawl meat is 65 gold and the clams are 10 gold each which makes this a surprisingly good farm. Now if you're a low level this could be really good to just make some gold on your way if you're a new player coming back to the game and you're making a lion's character a lion's over horde every day probably lose some views for that then this could be a really nice farm particularly because you can level up the traditional route go through elwyn forest and then you could come to westfall and just grind a couple levels on these and sometimes it's nice to kind of bring in the old realm of farming like we used to because i feel like one of the passions and the desires for Season of Discovery is just the simplicity of just grinding gold. Many people think you have to be an expert in the auction house to make loads of gold. You've got to get your crafting up and, com and compete with multiple other crafters. It's simply not the case. You can simply kill things and earn gold. And truth be told, that's how I earn most of my gold. Now... Most of you that watch the stream know that during my downtime, particularly whilst I'm waiting for solo queue like I am here, I really enjoy making some gold. And many people ask me, what do you do? What's the best gold making method now? Now, I'm not a hardcore gold farmer. I just do the same things over and over again. And if I find something new, then I add that to my ever-growing catalog. And this is one of those moments where... I happen to be doing something else and lo and behold, I kill a few of these things and you make some gold from it. Now, a little disclaimer, I haven't been to the auction house and tried to sell these yet and I'm not using TSM because I just think it's a overly bloated add-on if I'm not doing transmog. Little story about my transmog at the moment, I'm actually disenchanting uh, 1,500 green items and keeping any items worth over 10k to transfer to an RP realm because I truly believe that unless you're on an RP server, transmog is not worth doing. I've had big ticket items that are worth well into the 100, 200k mark and they're claimed to be good sellers and truth be told, they just have not sold. Anyway guys, the last thing I want to mention whilst I'm killing these beautiful looking murlocs with the traditional sound of that was terrible murloc sound <laughs> um please don't forget that i'm giving away one million gold this is the celebration for the channel reaching 1000 subscribers now the caveat to this is that i want to reward obviously those loyal viewers subscribers the people that are always there in my stream with something back now don't worry if you're not uh on eu i will ensure that you get the equivalent uh, of whatever you win somehow on your server i promise you that i will do that so i don't want to exclude i know i have a lot of na viewers um danny toxy nick those uh sort of people i know you're on different servers but if you win something uh in one of the giveaways i promise that i'm going to uh, make sure you guys receive it some way or somehow so for the kind of stream what i'm going to do is I, i'm going to have a few competitions uh my mods will probably be helping me and will be excluded from the giveaway so that'll be asgard and 
uh, people so you get the luxury of simply being <laughs> being with me in most streams um, but yeah do remember guys it starts at 8 o'clock UK time and if you're on East Coast I believe that is 3 p.m. An A time and the stream will probably last two to three hours. Um, you may catch me on. But yeah, it should be a good one and it should be a really nice celebration. And uh, I'm obviously working on the road to a million series. I, I've not forgotten. Time is just a bit of a struggle right now and trying to get out all the content, work on two or three projects of videos. Um, it can be difficult and trying to enjoy the game. You've got to remember I'm human and I can't always be like a robot. I have to have some enjoyment and I want this to have longevity in it, this YouTube channel, and I want to keep making it grow and just build a really nice community and be somewhat of a resource for new players, returning players, and even players that are looking to get into PvP. Anyway, guys, if you have enjoyed the video, please do hit that subscribe button. Drop me a like and turn that notification bell on. Additionally, if you've got any more energy left in your legs or you're fed up of hearing my voice, you can head over to Twitch and drop me a follow. The link is in the description. I do go live most week evenings uh, at least three or four times. So it'll give you a really nice way to connect with me. We've got a lovely kind of warm uh, community that comes over there. And the stream is obviously a really nice and safe space to chill. In the meantime, guys, don't flame me for this farm if it doesn't make you loads of gold. I just wanted to share the values of uh, what the crawl me and the clamshells were worth. In the meantime, guys, stay merry. Have a fantastic build up to Christmas and Christmas Day if I don't speak to you and most of all be kind be peaceful and remember you are appreciated bye